Hey everybody, today is April 24th. I'm Adam and this is your daily dose of today. I realize I probably look a little disheveled and not very well put together, but today has been a very busy day. Uh, traveled to Toronto from New York today. I have spent the last several hours preparing some documents for uh, an internal initiative that I am leading and and I am getting ready to go to a, another meeting here in just uh, about another hour. So the day's not over for me yet. But you know what? I want to celebrate some victories today. I thought about what to speak about today and I think it's overdue to celebrate some victories. First, for some victories on my own personal way, last week and earlier this week, I got to do things I haven't been able to do in a long time. Uh, I completed I competed in a partner workout at my box, which has been many weeks because of my shoulder surgery. And I tell you, uh, I didn't feel full strength and back to speed, but it just felt amazing to be uh, doing battle again with my brothers and sisters where I work out at. Uh, it was like a push up and ring row and running workout, and it just felt good to be back in the routine again. Uh, I felt alive. Which is what it's a part of, which is what it's uh, all about, right? I also I got under the bar, so doing some um, clean and jerks and some snatches again, lightweight, but I got to work out with uh, one of my main buddies, and you know I was exhausted, I was tired at the end, and I have a long way to go still, but it felt great to do that. I got to get above the bar, so I was doing banded pull-ups, so. I'm not back to full weight yet because of my shoulder and I'm taking it easy, And but it felt good to just have my head above the bar, um, even with the help of some assistance of bands. So I take all those things as great. It's great to get out there and run and still show my moxie um, and to have fun. And that was great. From a professional standpoint, my gosh, I've had a great week. Uh, I've had great meetings with customers and potential customers that uh, I was... I was on fire, like I was, I was in my element, and so I got great reports on that, that those were successful from the people I worked with. Uh, I've learned a lot this week, thanks to um, uh, some great coursework put out by Courtney Kistler. Uh, refreshed me on some things I knew, but honestly gave me some better perspective, uh, which is sometimes all you need is a new perspective on things you already knew that can unlock some great things, and that's been extremely helpful this week. So thank you, Courtney, for that. But then also, uh, too, like the, the, the great things that you guys have accomplished that you've told me about. And I've said it, that you've shared with me some of those things, and I want to share those now. So since starting just a few weeks ago, some of the things that's happened is uh, I, I met somebody uh, that told me they were going to start writing a book. They identified me, and I'd never met them before, but because of these... And there was completely in a different state. It's crazy. But they told me because of these videos, he's like, I'm gonna start writing that book I'd always been putting off. That's incredible and good for you. And that's awesome. Thank you for sharing. Uh, another was um, you know, someone had shared with me that uh, that they saw that they because of my videos, they stayed uh, gave him encouragement to go after and keep pursuing a job. Uh, and also a uh, a master's but the same person and they got the job and they're starting the masters uh in this in this field like how awesome is that um that, that's just incredible people in action i love it another person shared that um that they are going to start writing a manuscript uh that they've been putting off again super awesome um yeah so so all these uh different stories and then i even had a more serious one where um uh someone shared that they were actually had been uh having uh, contemplations of, of suicide and, and uh, because of this it helped them kind of shake off that and reframe life in their perspective and I encourage that person to still continue to seek um, uh, actual professional help for that because those are very serious things but glad if nothing else that we've been able to help um, cut the edge off of that. All these things I didn't even have my wildest imaginations of what could actually do. And there's many more stories, uh, I say many more, probably five or six more stories that, that I could share of people just reaching out and saying, like, this has been encouragement. And I say all this not because I think what 
this thing that I'm doing is some miraculous, awesome thing, but I, I want you, if you're watching, to realize that there are many people in the same boat as you, right? And look, if me, just a humble hill jack <laughs> from Kentucky, is able to reach out and touch these people, remember our one millionth of 1%, 75 people or what have you, uh, if, we, if I can reach out and touch this many people, so can you. Think of the positive impact you can have and look at just what I'm doing is I'm just sharing uh, what my life experiences and, and what I found to be helpful in helping me and it's helping others. And so if you just maybe open up a little bit, pour into others, what are the things that you could do and accomplish? And if you have stories to share, please drop those in the comments below uh, and I'd love to hear those as well. Thanks so much for being a part of this and I hope that uh, you're making the most of today. Conquer that 14%. Start where you are. Today looks good on you. This has been your daily dose of today.